Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. As you may know from my previous videos, I go to Stony Brook University, and right now I'm currently a junior, and I major in bio. And I want to give you guys a glimpse of what life is like as a bio major here um, during a pandemic. So I hope you guys enjoy. So it's about 9.20 in the morning, and I always try going to office hours for biochem because it's pretty hard, and I always have a lot of questions. So right now, He's going over the basics of glycolysis and if we look we have a lot of people in office hours um it's probably because we have an exam coming up in a few days so i think everybody is just trying to cram in their questions now hello everybody as part of being an ra i have to work in the quad office i have not gotten breakfast yet so um I am a little bit hungry, to be honest. Hey, Michael. Me and my bud, Michael, are working right now in the quad office. But it's not really busy now, so I'm going to do my homework now. So I'm doing my discussion board for my EST class. And you know how it's like, hey, I really agree with you. So this is a liquid nitrogen tank and it's where we store all of our cells. This is what it looks like when you open it. from March 2nd, 2020, and it's October now, so that's really cool. Now we have to melt this, so I'm gonna put it in a warm bath. It's been about two hours, and look at them. They're still alive. Hi, Jess. Hi. <laughs> so my friend drove me to Target. I'm gonna go on a food run. <laughs> I got some milk and I also got some Auntie Anne's mac and cheese. And I also got some Madeline's. Yeah. So I'm gonna get breakfast now and I always get the same breakfast every day here. <clears throat> and it's the egg and cheese sandwich. I'm getting my breakfast and I see this person who are you? Here we go. Okay, am I feeling a bacon, egg, and cheese? Or an egg and cheese? I'll go for a bacon, egg, and cheese. Mm, which one? I'll get this one. So I'm walking to the library right now. And I'm gonna try and get some studying done. I also have a lab report that's due for physics. So I'm gonna have to finish that. It's due tomorrow. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. Just some studying um, and finishing up lab report. Thank you.
I tried blue cheese for the first time. Hopefully I don't regret it. It looks kind of weird. Look at the view. I just did all my work, I came back, and now it's time for hall council, and I have to go because I am an RA. Oh, I wouldn't have got that. <laughs> Almost found Today was a long day. Honestly, I didn't finish everything I wanted to finish. Like, I didn't study as much as I should have for my exam coming up. But it's okay. There's always tomorrow. I'm gonna try waking up early tomorrow, maybe go to the gym. I don't know if I'll be able to, but I'll try. Good morning. I completely slept past my alarm. And it's 10.30 now. I have to get ready soon to get my as usual egg and cheese. And then, I have physics lab right after. Yes, that's me. I don't know who put this here, but someone did it on my birthday. I think it was one of my residents. I have no idea though, but I like the effort. Okay, go. Go, I said go. I said go. <laughs> Just finished Roanoke for American Horror Story and look Season 7 just came out for the 100 <laughs> I really 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 want to watch it now but I have to study What do I do? <laughs> oh my gosh, okay I'm gonna study Take my exam on Monday and then I'm gonna binge watch this whole season I'm so excited. I've been watching The 100 for years now. Uh, finally, the last season came out. Good morning. It's 9.15 a.m. And I slept past my alarm. But I did make it in time for office hours, so I'm gonna go to that right now. Uh, James, can you go over question 19 on fall 2018? Unless you want to retake the course in the spring, at which point you can uh, <laughs> do all of these questions with the person who wrote these questions. Um, uh, it's okay. <laughs> I pass. But we're working on the assumption that that's not going to happen. Dear James, you currently have a package at the Irving Mailroom Mailroom. Use this barcode to pick up your package. I thought this would be a lot bigger, but it's not. It's also not as heavy as I expected. So I finally came. Got this. So I've been trying to go to the gym more, you know, to get those gains. 
and my friend told me that I should invest in some protein powder. So, yeah, I don't know. I don't like the way protein shakes taste, but he said that this is a pretty good brand and it tastes pretty good. Got the double rich chocolate, so we'll see how it goes. I'm hoping this thing will last me a long time because it was kind of expensive. It was like 60 bucks for this five pound container. Oof, it's raining so much right now, but I just came back from the dining hall. I got myself some lunch slash breakfast and I have a zoo meeting now that I have to go to. This is just where we basically choose a paper and as lab we go over the paper in detail and critique it or just analyze it pretty much. <sighs> the dining hall. I don't know what that is. Hello everybody. So I came back from the gym and I decided to go to the dining hall before I head back because I was kind of hungry. And honestly, the dining hall isn't my number one choice. You know, to eat on campus, like that will be my last resort. Um, but I just have so many swipes like sitting in my account that they're gonna go to waste if I don't use them. So I'll be eating dining hall food tonight. Um, and it's also kind of hard because if you don't eat dining hall food, you kind of have to eat at a retail place. So for example, on campus we have Jasmine and um, it's good, but it's kind of expensive. So if you're like me who, who and you don't really, you kind of just, and you're not really good at budgeting for food, <laughs> um, then you're gonna run out of money because Jasmine is expensive. So yeah, I'm kind of low on dining dollars, which is what we call like the money we use for retail. And I kind of have to start using more swipes now, you know, in the next couple of days. So, I mean, I don't even know what I got from the dining hall, but whatever it is, it worked out. I got this, I don't know, guacamole with steak and rice and some eggplant. Um, I don't know, but I'm gonna eat it now, so yeah. Lately, honestly, I've been just binge watching American Horror Story because it's so addicting. Um, so let me know in the comments what season is your favorite. All of my traumatic labs have been in this building. Bad memories, bad memories. So today is Wednesday, and Wednesday is probably my busiest day of the week. But right now, I'm going to eat my breakfast. My bacon, egg, and cheese. Really yummy. And then I'm probably gonna shower afterwards. And then I have a meeting after at 11.30, so I'll see you guys later. Hey guys, so I just finished my health and safety inspections. It took about an hour to do all of them. And I only had one violation. Um, on my whole floor, so I'm really happy because that means that everyone followed the rules. So many hours. It it all. I'm. I hope it all. You know, is worth it in the end. Oh my gosh. Like. <sighs> Anyways, off topic, but. I tried the protein shake that I got recently and I was scared at first because I don't like protein shakes because they taste kind of bad but I was really surprised at this one it tasted really good now I have to go back and study more I, I only finished five lectures so far and I have five more to go what is it 
enzyme inhibition, carbs, glycolysis, single transduction, metabolism. I don't know, I guess it's okay. It starts in literally five seconds. I gotta go now, bye. Good luck, good, good luck everybody. Post biochem exam. Actually, I can't rest now. I have to attend my orgo lecture, which started three minutes ago, but I'm late. So I'm a TA for organic chemistry. I really like TAing for the class. It's really fun. Probably one of the best experiences I had so far, TAing for any class. And I'm supposed to come and look at lecture so that I could help my students whenever they ask me questions. But yeah, overall, 9 out of 10 experience. So if you guys have the opportunity to TA for organic chemistry, I would highly recommend, especially here at Stony Brook. It's really rewarding. I'm also a trained crisis tech design counselor, and I try my best to come on here whenever I can to help out. Uh, for those of you who don't know, Crisis Tech Science basically is a text and service that deals with all sorts of things, but uh, I would say that they specialize mainly in mental health, so like uh, if you're feeling down or depressed or, you know, even more serious matters like suicide, uh, this Crisis Tech Science service uh, is aimed to help texters who are going through a rough patch. So I try to come on here every now and then. Uh, since the college has been just so time consuming, so I haven't been able to come on here as much, but I try to whenever I can. So there you guys have it. This is kind of a taste of what being a bio major here at Stony Brook University is like during this pandemic. I apologize, the video was really long. I kind of just videoed myself randomly throughout the day and then slapped them together in iMovie. I would say that this is a pretty accurate week of what I would do. What I do in a week depends on, you know, my schedule. A lot of the things I used to do were canceled because of COVID, unfortunately, but I tried my best to show what I do now. But definitely leave a comment below if you want to see anything or have any questions about Stony Brook in general. And thank you for watching. And yeah, have a good day, guys.